Yo, what's going on guys? Your boy Vita here back on the Madden 16. Today I got you guys a Turbo Blitz out of Nickel Normal. Uh, I'm running the Bengals playbook now, so uh, all my Blitz are going to be out of the Bengals playbook. So this is Nickel Normal. Anything with Nickel Normal, this Blitz is going to work in. All you want to do is just have your best speed, Excel combination at left end. <coughs> if you got Mutt, you know, just about everyone's quick. Just put a linebacker down there, you're good to go. We're going to just kind of borrow in. He's only got 89 Excel, but he's at 92 speed. So that should be enough to get it through. It's going to be more consistent the more speed and Excel you have. But we're going to do our best to do it with reg teams to show you guys. So we're going to do nickel normal and come out in the nickel blitz too, like so. And what we want to do is base align, shift our linebackers, or spread our linebackers, shift our line to the left. And to do that, you just want to hit Y and then right. And then right on the D-pad, up on the D-pad, left on the D-pad, left on the D-pad. In that order. You want to try and get it done before your line sets. Uh, you also, I think, I don't know if I said that. You want to crash middle too, which is left on the D-pad and down on the right stick. So we're going to pick the play, baseline, spread, shift left, crash middle like that. And we want to take our user and move him in three steps like that. Hold RT. Then when we snap the ball, we're going to see we're going to be able to shoot straight through the... E a gap? I think that's actually an A gap, even though we're supposed to be over the B gap. So same setup here. We want to do is just spread our uh, spread our linebacker, shift our line to the right, and sometimes I don't know why that happened, but it, he definitely looks to be a little bit off. So gonna, that looks about right. Might not come in this time, but uh, but the more speed and excel you have, the better uh, the better chance you have of getting it in. So it's the same setup. I'm going to show you guys again. Just snap the ball, and that time it's going to get picked up. But he was untouched as well. I'm pretty sure because some. Sometimes when you get picked up, usually someone else is going to come in. Usually it's going to be Nolan Carroll from me. Uh, so you that that's the blitzing uh, <coughs> the blitzing cornerback, which is going to be your third string cornerback. So your slot, you usually have us have have a pretty quick slot cornerback, anyways. So try and make sure you have a decent uh, slot cornerback, maybe someone with decent block shed. Uh, because you, if they're playing the run, you definitely want to have someone who can get off a block over there. Come out the same play, baseline spread, shift to the left, crash middle. We just want to take our guy and move him in three steps like so. When we snap the ball, we're just going to move him through the B-gap. That time I got bumped, but I was still perfectly fine. You know, that that's going to happen sometimes. It's okay. Uh, we're still screaming. You know, we, we still made it through way before he was going to be able to make a read. So move in three steps like that. Snap the ball. That time we get, once again, we get pushed off to the side. I kind of, I would have easily been able to run around the corner and get him, but I kind of looked down at the controller because I thought I actually got picked up. But uh, I did get pushed off to the side. I'll be, I'm going to show you guys it uh, a few more. I'm going to show you guys under center and shit in a second when I get the ball back. I'll be right back. All right, so here we are again, guys. This time we're going well, nickel normal just like before and nickel blitz too. This time we're going to come out uh, just in some under center play. Uh, pick curls. We want to baseline, spread, shift to the left, crash middle like that. We want to take our user, move him in three steps like so. Snap the ball, and we are just going to absolute. Wow, really? Really, really, really. You, as you guys can see, we just absolutely screamed through that gap. We hit him before he was even done, like, doing his backup animation. But, unfortunately, he broke the tackle off. Uh, it's it, This is, like, an absolute screamer, guys. I'm going to show you guys an instant replay real fast. I didn't fuck it up, but... You see, we are just going to scream and tackle him, like, before he even, like, stops his automatic drop back. That's how crazy this blitz is. I'll show you guys one more time. Baseline, spread, shift to the left, crash middle. If I went too fast for you guys, I'll have the setup in the description like I always do. Sh move him in three steps like that. Crash middle again because sometimes, I, I like crash middle like a thousand times because sometimes you just don't get the, the proper arrow down. Look like my defensive tackle didn't shift over as far as he's supposed to, so it might not come in this time, but we're just going to go ahead and... Yeah, something was definitely wrong that time, but you could see Nolan Carroll came through the B gap that time. Sometimes that's going to happen. He still came in incredibly quick, and that's, so that's okay with us. Um, you know, it's not... Like I said, the, sometimes your players just don't line up correctly. Uh, I've, I mean, I've been running it in mud. You guys see my videos. Like, I run this every once in a while. Uh, it's it definitely... it's consist, If it's consistent enough for me to run it, then it's definitely a consistent blitz. It's baseline, spread, shift to the left, crash, middle, like so. I just want to move him in three steps. Crash middle, like, seven more times. Snap the ball... And I, for some reason, it didn't crash middle. I didn't get, like, really a, a speed boost. But we still got, like, instant pressure from Nolan Carroll, which is just going to happen. I know it's sometimes under center. Uh, it's just you're going to get some weird. That This is looking good. Sometimes when you're under center, you're, uh, 
your line just doesn't, uh, like your defensive tackle doesn't shift left all the way like he should. But that time he did, that's why we were able to scream. But you guys can see this works. I think it it works under pistol uh, too. Actually, it doesn't work under pistol. Um, but as you guys can see, this blitz is absolutely killer. Uh, definitely check out my other blitzes too, because you don't just want to run one blitz the whole goddamn game. Uh, so this is going to be in a playlist of all the blitzes that work. I'm going to update the playlist for every time I upload a new blitz that works. It's going to be in there. And anytime uh, a patch happens, I'm going to remove all the plays that got patched from the uh, from the patch. So if there's never going to be a non-working blitz in there, anytime something gets patched, I'm going to take it out and make sure that that playlist is always going to have working blitzes for you guys. Also, check out the Gun Bunch Week playlists. I've been uploading all sorts of videos for you guys in the Money Plays. Shit, I got a bunch of week. It's turned into a nice little mini scheme. I'm probably going to be switching formations here soon because I'm just about done with it. Uh, but I think that's it for this video, guys. If you'd like to give it a like, comment, and subscribe, follow me on Twitter. It'll be down in the description below. And as always, yeah.